I had a bout with prostate cancer and that caused uh, me to have an operation. Didn't take me long to get over it because I was still reasonably fit. So things went along in a jolly fashion. I got over it. During the recuperation from that disease, I had to go to a physiotherapist where they put us in for a bit of recuperation. And there was quite a number of other men there. I noticed how difficult it was for men to get up off the ground, to do stretching exercises, to move in a fashion, because I'd been a runner and I was still reasonably fit, to move in a fashion which I thought was a healthy way to move. So after I retired from work, I went to TAFE and over an 18 month period, I acquired a diploma of fitness. Currently, I do mixed classes and men's classes. And then my PSA started to rise again. So I did radiotherapy in a new machine at the local hospital. That went all right for two or three years. But then just recently, my PSA has risen again. My doctor put me in last week for a PET scan. We're not sure where that's going with that PET scan, the results of that PET scan that could be good, could be bad. From that PET scan the other day, now through the rest of my journey, I'll be able to use my health record, as will any practitioner, and know exactly where I'm at. Only the doctor can have access. The main objection, I think, for my classes are what about security? I'm not sure why they're worried about security. You're floating in an ocean and you've got this life preserver of my health record that can tell any practitioner anywhere in Australia your health history. And it's just so important. So don't take it for granted. Be part of my health record and it could be your life preserver.